Um, in the wake of the tragedy, serious questions have been raised about the causes of the explosion and the adequacy of industry practices and regulatory standards relating to oil and gas drilling. We must take action to improve industry practices and strengthen regulatory standards to try to ensure that this never happens again. Um, before us today is the Blowout Prevention Act of 2010. The legislation establishes a number of standards and procedures to help ensure that the use of appropriate safety equipment and practices during high-risk oil and uh, gas drilling activities. Um, it's good legislation. I think it can be improved. In particular, I'd like to discuss with witnesses uh, the addition of acoustic backup control systems and other emergency backup control systems. What really uh, frustrates uh, all of us is that we had been told time and time again uh, that things of this magnitude uh, really could never happen and that if it did happen there would be all kinds of safeguards in place and we see now that that was really not the case. So I have a hard time um, believing uh, oil uh, executives uh, when they give us reassurances that this is a, a once in a lifetime thing and it can't happen again. Um, I thank you Mr. Chairman. I, I thank you for um, for uh, uh, pushing uh, this bill. I thank you for the hearings we've had. Uh, I think the American people uh, want to get to the bottom of this, are very, very upset with this. And obviously this is a, a, a catastrophe of monumental proportions uh, for our lifetime and generations to come. I yield back.